everyone, I'm Helena Mackay. I'm a recruiter at Phoenix Children's Hospital, specifically recruiting for nurses. Um, so really excited to chat with you today about my role um, and kind of what you can look for in jobs at Phoenix Children. administration so my degree is in healthcare um, and kind of found a love in recruiting and recruiting for nurses so super excited and um, really happy that you chose this field it's a great field um, in healthcare to be serving the patients and children I think my biggest piece of advice for freshmen and sophomores would be um, to really kind of get out there and start maybe looking into some volunteer experiences um, Phoenix Children's offers um, volunteering um, through our hospital that you can find on our website, um, the phoenixchildrens.com website. Um, so that'll be a great place to kind of start and to be able to kind of see what's out there um, that you can um, start your career. Also, we have um, patient care technicians, which are like certified nursing assistants, um, that if you're looking to work, um, you can do that as well. Um, but that is a, a paid position and you know, you would have to work in that role. However, it gives you that experience um, prior to being a nurse. So the hiring process um, specifically for new graduate nurses um, is a pretty simple and straightforward. Um, we do a group called Hire Ahead at Phoenix Children's, um, and that is the group where new grads would fall into. Um, and what we do is we post a position for all Hire Ahead um, nurses. It's just gonna be one position that's gonna be up on our website, um, and we would share that position with you, and it'd also be visible externally as well under Hire Ahead. Um, so you would apply to just that role, and then that is all encompassing. So that would be for all um, open nurse roles that we have for new grads in that position um, and then based upon our chats and stuff like that we would determine where you would go in your units um, and stuff like that and then we would move you into the correct jobs as needed um, we would have a phone call with you as the recruiter so we would chat with you and do a phone interview kind of learn a little bit more about you um, and then we would share your information and get you set up with the hiring manager um, of that specific unit um, and you would interview with the hiring manager and then after that the hiring manager would let us know how everything went um, hopefully an offer um, and we would um, then take that process over as the recruiter to move you along in the hiring process after that. So it depends on per semester. Um, so for December graduates, um, we would be looking at um, having you applying um, either in February or March um, around that time frame. And the requirement for that would be to have your um, test date um, by that date. And then for the spring group, we would be looking at about July time frame. Also there having your NCLEX date. And then summer would be around October. Um, so that's kind of the time frames that we'd be looking for there um, in terms of that, but just being sure that you have your, te your test date of NCLEX is very important. And then as a recruiter, kind of what I'm looking for, um, I mean, resumes are very important to us. You know, we do um, kind of look through those, but I will say that um, kind of having those key words are really important in nursing, um, you know, so being specific to pediatrics or being specific to if you're interested in cardiac pediatrics or emergency room pediatrics is very um, important um, because we look for those key words in that resume. Um, so having that is important. And then when we chat with you on the phone, um, being excited and being wanting to join Phoenix Children's is really something that I look for. Um, I want to get excited to talk to you on the phone just as much as I'm sure you would like to talk to me as well. Yeah, we have some great benefits at PCH. Um, we um, are very competitive with the market um, and we are very committed to um, providing some of the best benefits for our employees. Um, we have comprehensive medical benefits, including vision and dental. Um, and then we also have some other um, perks with our benefits. We do a wellness program where we have a gym on campus. It's a small gym, but um, we do have a gym on campus where you we have yoga classes um, and, and different classes available. We also have um, pet therapy day where the staff um, come down and um, you can 
hug and love on different dogs and we have a cat too um, as well and um, we have pet benefits at PCH, adoption benefits, um, and also tuition reimbursement. So if you're looking to further your education past your BSN, um, we have those benefits available to employees as well. Um, PCH and Dignity has partnered out in Gilbert um, and we are going to be going in with um, Dignity on our Mercy Gilbert campus. Um, so that campus will be very unique um, and not really something that we've done before. Um, we will have a women's health and a children's um, campus all mixed into one. Um, so Dignity Health will help us out with the women's portion of it and then Phoenix Children's would do the um, children's aspect of it. Um, but 2021 is what we're kind of projecting at this time. It'll be a great opportunity for our friends and um, employees that live out in the East Valley. Um, and to serve that community out there is something that's really important to us. So we're really looking forward to kind of building our um, Phoenix Children's name and kind of growing more as a health system. If you're viewing this video you're already doing something right so I think that um, it's a huge step and um, you know I've worked with many of the partners here at ASU and you guys have some great partnerships here with them and I would say it's really important that you utilize all those benefits that they give you guys with resume building and meeting with them to chat about interviews it's all um, very very valuable um, to your education and to kind of um, you know, looking into careers such as Phoenix Children's as a nurse. So we wish you all the best and um, hopefully we get to chat with you all soon.